Gather round, children, it's time for Last Good Milk Pig. I'm Johnny Saint, and today we're playing Alan Wake. Alright, so, picking up right where we left off here. Um, like, literally right where we left off. We just ended the last episode, like... Alice? Honey? A minute ago or something. So. Come on, you were gone for five minutes. And now she's disappeared. Oh boy, a coffee. Hi. I'm upstairs. I have a surprise for you. Oh, uh, uh oh. Well then. This well, isn't going to be a PG episode. I'm not surprised. It's in the study. Go take a look. <laughs> okay. Alright. In the study? Where's the study? I don't even... There's no other doors. Oh. Surprise! Alice? Oh boy, what is this? Type I guess writer. I have a small confession to make. I thought maybe you could write here that a change of scenery would get you past- Damn, Alice, you- Everyone- Hey, has... hey, hey! Just hear me out! There's a local doctor, Dr. Hartman. I read a book of this. He has a private clinic here. He specializes in helping uh, artists. So Maybe. now you want to get me committed? No! It's not like that! That's not- Alan? Oh. Alan? I don't, I just don't. Going. I don't want to hear it. God damn it, Alice. God damn it. I knew she wouldn't the follow heck? me in the dark. I needed some time alone to think things through. Oh, oh slow down there, buddy. There was definitely flashes of something damn it. when the lights went out. Episode's already a thousand times more exciting than the last. Alice? Oh. Alice? What? Oh come on. Oh no! Uh oh. That in the Keep going. Forgot that was all a flashback. Waking up in the crashed car felt like I had woken from one nightmare and entered another. Uh -oh. I couldn't remember how I got there. All I knew was that something terrible had happened to Alice. Yeah. The phone was dead. I'd have to find help on foot. Among Alice's things was a book, The Creator's Dilemma, by a Dr. Emil Hartman. Seeing the book brought back my fight with Alice. I didn't like it, and I didn't like the guy's smug face on the cover either. Who? I don't like your smug face. The gas station was my best bet. They'd have a phone I could use. It looked like a long hike through the forest to get there. Yeah, probably. Okay, let's get hiking. Oh, oh, here goes the car. 
operative. But I don't need it. Okay. Would have been a great mayhem commercial for Allstate. Is it Allstate? I think it's Allstate. Not that it matters. Hello? Uh, God, is that you? Hello? Someone there? Or is there a train? What the heck? The loose sheets of paper were pages from a manuscript entitled Departure. That was the name I planned to use for the next novel I had never gotten started. I was named the author. I hadn't written it. I couldn't remember writing it. In the scene on the page, the hero was attacked by an axe murderer in the woods at night. <laughs> okay. Departure by Alan Wake. The man turned to face me. His face was covered in shadows. It was hard to make him out in the darkness of the forest that surrounded us. But the axe he lifted was plain to see. It glistened with the blood of his victim. He grinned madly. The shadows were alive, distorting his features. It was a scene from a nightmare. But I was awake. Well, then that's uh, pretty intense. You were awake, a wake, Alan Wake. Oh, wow. What? Wow. Guessing that's intentional. I was a wake the whole time. Uh, Anybody there? Please, I've been in an accident. Hmm. Come on, where am I going here? The lights up ahead were a good sign. Maybe I wouldn't have to hike all the way down to the gas station to find a phone. Oh, yeah, sure. Because this looks like something that good things are going on. Anybody Ow. there? Please, I've been in an accident. Yes, you, you said that already. But thanks. Hey! Hey, you! Fail! There's been an accident. I need help. Listen, Deposit. I need to cabins for rent in oh hell Carl oh, no. Stucky please to beat you non refundable reservation has required fair and square what the heck and square well that was uh Yeah, it's totally great to meet you too, buddy. How do I... Oh boy. Coffee thermos. That's going to be helpful. The Taken stood before me. It was impossible to focus on it as if it stood in a blind spot caused by a brain tumor and eye disease. It was bleeding shadows like ink underwater, like a cloud of blood from a shark bite. I was terrified. I squeezed the flashlight like my life depended on it, willing it to stop coming any closer. Suddenly something gave, and the light seemed to shine brighter. Hmm. Well. I have no clue what's going on. They definitely do some 
good imagery with the words. You lose? Shit. But it. It's um, the latest two. thing! You? Two birds? Incontestable. Well, I'm gonna die. Great! Oh. I had to figure a way out of this. Any second now, and Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. <laughs> yep. Okay. Well, that was convenient. During your trying, it's the latest. In and yes. Probably. Right, Mall Sheriff Station. Oh man. Two. Hello? Hello? Oh, of course. Stone. You can see the sights and keep those molesters Did I die? I think I died. Alrighty. Let's pick up the batteries first. During your pick up the ammo. Trying. Yeah. Here. Yes. Yeah, the phone right works. Hello. Hello. Oh, that guy is really freaking out. This bad. Oh, yeah, you think so? Okay. Oh, that is nice of him to perfectly knock the door open. Alright, well, checkpoint reached, and I don't know what's going on, but this day of game is definitely getting a lot, uh, The lot bulldozer more had gone interesting. over the cliff with the office. I hope Stucky had yeah. suffered the same fate, but I wasn't planning well, on staying so. to find out. Yeah. Well, we reached a checkpoint there, so I think I'm going to leave it there. Um, more interesting, still not 100% sold on this game, but uh, let me know what you guys think, or if you've played it before, and it's worth continuing. I mean, I'll probably continue it, but uh, yeah, so anyhow, thanks for stopping by, and we'll see you next time.